Good day, everyone. How are you today? I'm back. And today I will be talking about a topic that will be working in conjunction with another video I will pre be producing. Uh, this video is going to be about uh, prostitution in the United States and its variety of forms. Um, prostitution women being whores is pretty much illegal in most forms in the United States and I'm going to talk about some of these forms that you are aware of or maybe you are not aware of and then on the second video I'm going to be producing is why isn't all forms of prostitution legal it's called the world's oldest profession and let's start with the most simple form that is present in the United States and that's the street prostitution where the worker is called the, a street walker you know it's just, uh, pretty much a simple system where a sex worker just waits on the street for solicitors or people who want the services and just come up to them and uh, ask them for sex, how much, you know, boom, bada, bada. Happens really quick. A lot of these people uh, use drugs and have some other issues um, going on with them. In the United States, in June 2015, being a streetwalker and soliciting a streetwalker is illegal all throughout the United States. All right, let's move on. Next we have what we call escort prostitution in which the worker, the sex worker, uh, would be reach via phone call. I suppose this could be done. Um, well, I, well, I guess they wouldn't have a website in the United States for this yet because it's still legal but <clears throat> you know you just give them call it sometimes they call these uh working girls call girls there's different names for these but they're all whores really they're, they're, they're paid for sex they're prostitutes uh this as far as i know is also illegal everywhere in the united states in uh june 2015 but it's pretty tolerated in some places uh, well, of course, you know, in Vegas, at the very least, is uh, tolerated. So let's move on to what I like to call whorehouses, otherwise known as brothels, brothel prostitutions. Brothels, of course, house prostitutes. Clients will go to the brothel, come in. Fuck the sex worker or prostitute. Leave. Pretty simple, right? Simple, clear, cut, and dry. And this is only legal in Nevada. Everywhere else is pretty much banned illegal for reasons. I don't know. But we're going to talk about that later. And in that second video, I was talking about. Next, I want to talk about what they call sugar baby prostitution sugar baby prostitution is pretty much illegal in the United States it's where a woman fancies herself uh, uh, she's made to be exalting beautiful young and she finds what you call a sugar daddy or a sugar mommy which is, of course, the client normally has a lot of money. The sugar baby is given allowance. This uh, form of prostitution is very long term. And lastly, let's talk about the form of prostitution that everybody's familiar with. And that, of the course, is porno or pornography or simply porn. We're all familiar with this. But in this um, form of prostitution, the Johns are actually 
the people who watch porn who consume it. They don't necessarily pay all the time, but the people who consume it, who watch the videos, these are both men and women. Uh, both the males and females who participate in porn are essentially prostitutes on camera. And while this is acceptable, well, well some people find it appalling, uh, this is also a legal form of prostitution. Everybody has to be at least 18 to participate. And uh, like the uh, prostitutes that work at the brothel in Nevada, uh, this income is taxable. So Uncle Sam is uh, pretty cool with this one. And I guess it's all right. Uh, now for all my listeners, uh, my viewers, uh, I don't recommend uh, prostitution in any form. Thank you very much. The power is yours.